Attention, attention, attention. If you would like to support your homeboy Kendrick Avant, go to Facebook, look up Kendrick Avant, and you can watch and vibe and rock and roll with all my reels, man. Get educated, be entertained, be inspired. Kendrick Avant on Facebook. Check out those reels. Tuesday, day 38, man. So let me give the first salutation, the salutes, and everything to a good CBD shop. I'm talking about the kind of CBD shop that when you slide in, they can talk to you about the different kinds of CBD. They can talk to you about the different kinds of Kratom, the Green Bali, the Green Dragon, the Purple this and that. Yo, dog, you want a CBD shop that knows the difference between screens and filters the pipes, the vapes, everything that they have so you know what the hell you buying and you can get the best effect for what you're looking for. Mushrooms, all that kind of good stuff. A thousand thank yous, man. CBD shops, it's a whole bunch of fakes out there. But to the good ones, I bow my head. Enjoy yourselves. Swinging and banging on the ones and twos. Allow me to reintroduce myself to you. I'm Kendrick Avant, your professor of gratitude journaling because all I'm ever going to do is slide in and help you see the stories, the why stories behind what you're grateful for. So you stop thinking about the abandonment, the critical illness, the imposter syndrome. That's all I'm here to do. And starting off, our gratitude journal is your intentions, your number one priority for today. This Tuesday, day number 38, my priority, self-care. I've got to wake up and do the meditation, wake up and do the stretching, wake up and do the yoga, wake up and drink my 25 ounces of water. Self-care is my priority, is my priority today. That is my intention today. Be clear of what the hell I'm doing. The call to action, same thing as Monday. It's gonna be like this all week. I got to start my work shift at least 30 minutes early so I can get caught up on everything that I'm behind on. And I got behind some more again yesterday because my computer was down for five of this eight hour shift. Starting off 30 minutes early, man. I gotta get this shit going. Yes, I learned something today. Drake came out last week. I didn't know that Erica Banks dropped last week. And that Erica Banks, I'm not gonna lie, man, she from Houston, right around, not Houston, Houston, but she from DeSoto, right around the corner. H-Town right here, that shit was jamming. I have no idea what the Drake sounds like because the Erica Banks was banging for me, dog. I put her in the line of like a lotto. All she's talking about is sex and being fly but she does it in a great way. And she's good with the wordplay, really, really good. So boom, that's what I learned. And the Erica Banks CD is popping. I told my cousin about it. King's Care. My lips have been chapped lately. I don't know if y'all can tell. I've been working on that. So today I'm taking extra good care of my lips. No nibbles, no bites, no tucks, no stretching them, no pulling on them. I'm going to be good. I'm a, I will be good today. I'm going to be good Tuesday and get a great start all day. I'm going to be keep my lips coated up, greased up, all that. I got two things to aqua for, so I got no excuses. King's News. Okay, I stopped scrolling when I read whenever my partners sent me. So I've seen this stuff. I've seen this stuff about Uganda getting the 31 million tons of gold they found in their, in their country. Man, that's worth $12 trillion. I had no idea how much it was worth, but when he sent me the video of how much that is worth, I'm immediately crunk and talking to the wife about it, and we're, we're both like, oh, hell yeah, Uganda finna pop off like that? Like, I hope Uganda does the type of shit where in order to move to Uganda, you gotta have your doctorate and everything. I want Uganda to get to be such a clown with it. They don't let anybody in that mud. Like I want Uganda to call us 
to come home. That's what I want to happen out there in Uganda. Let them be the kings, the leaders of everything popping off in Africa. Let that shit trickle down. Let me show y'all how trickle down economics supposed to work. When you got eight, when you got twelve trillion dollars to trickle down to your country and everything else, you want popping for your country first, and then you help out everybody else. Come on, Uganda, do do some shit and call for me to come home. Me, the queen, the kids, call for us to come home. Cause damn it, I will come. I'm not bullshit. I will come home. The goal today. Tuesday, I want to schedule out all of my posts for the different, I don't want to call them, the different adventure, the different business stuff I'm doing. So I want to keep everything going the way I've got it going with KendrickAvat.com to, to get the podcast going. This Tuesday, I need to add in some of the other business stuff. That's not just me. And that shit to be a lot easier to do because I know the simple messages of everything else. So that's my goal today, to get that stuff posted up, set up, lined up. Queen starts. Here we go. Fierce determination can bring many wonderful things into our lives. It takes hard work and focus to create greatness. I know. When we put our minds towards what we want instead of what isn't working, we harness our potential to make things happen. You have the power to be the change you want to see. Cute, huh? I know. So now what you got to do is write about your deepest desires and how you can make a move towards those desires today. Right here on Tuesday, day number 38. Keep going until you are closest to your desired outcome. Now what I can do I know I'm big on being this traveling speaker. I want to go to other countries, get the gratitude going, what I'm doing here, make that all pop. So what I can do is to focus and start doing the clubhouse rooms because that's a whole separate business venture. That goes along with things I can start scheduling out. And then I can tie that to the GoFundMe account to get the thing, the, the, to get the whole Grat God Squad, Gratitude Over Disability is going. But it starts with me lining this stuff up on the clubhouse, get that going, which goes to talking about the GoFundMe, which goes like, and then I can make a move. So that's how I can, that's how I can keep it going. Gratitudes, I know y'all here for this, man. I know y'all here for this good stuff. Number one, my number one gratitude is how my daughter set up all that Father's Day stuff, man. I'm still, I'm still touched. I'm still, I'm still waking up crunk about that dude. Um, she set up the whole video thing. She gave me, she gave me the daddy daughter chain. She made a digitized picture of me wearing some of my favorite pajamas and stuff like that. She, um, she got me the mindset over bullshit bracelet. Oh, you see, I can't even read it, can you? Look at that popping. And if you don't, if you're listening to this, all I'm doing is showing the stuff that my daughter created for me. So all of that is my very first gratitude. Remember, cheesiness, when you could take one thing and break it up into a whole bunch. So I'm going to show y'all how I can get cheesy with this. I'm going to give y'all four gratitudes. Each one will be what each one of the kids did for me. So the gratitude number two, my first adult, she made an awesome part of the video. She brought me my favorite ice cream, Millennium Crunch, my favorite candy, Kit Kats, and she brought me my favorite drink, Red Bull. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. All that kept me going. Uh, number three, gratitude. My other daughter bought me this fly ass shirt that says, awesome dads have tattoos and beards. I gotta get clean before I put that mug on, man. I guess I'll get that mug ready for Wednesday. And then last one, my son, oh, the queen got my favorite beer. They kept your boy buzzing and going for a great ass Father's Day weekend. And my son didn't buy me anything, but the dude came through and gave me like a hug from nowhere. Nowhere, like it, this this cat ain't hugged me in years. And just came out of nowhere early in the morning, then he disappeared the rest of the day. 
it was still cool beans, dog. So everybody got me something. And that's how you do a cheesy gratitude. When you're tired, take one thing, like what happened to me on Sunday, you break that into five. What each person did for you and talk about your wives with that. And then you got five gratitudes. That's how you do it, dog. I've been doing this for a while, man. Walk, rock with me, roll with me. Y'all be pretty. Stay grateful. I salute you. I am out. Thinking better. Being better starts with you getting a gratitude journal and following me every day on this journey. It all starts with you.